Hey everybody, welcome to Algo Prep Master. And in this video, I'm going to show you how to turn uh, React Native Expo app into APK. So this is the calculator app that I used in a different video. I'm going to leave I'm going to leave a link in the description of the video on how to code this calculator app so you can try it on your own. But in this video, we're going to turn this app into an APK and then install it on my Android phone. Um, so grab your laptop and let's start coding. So the first thing that we we're going to do is uh, start a new terminal and go into the folder where our project's in. And now we're going to do npm install and I forgot an L there, uh, but it's still installing and npm install dash G E E S dash C L I and let it install. Um, now that it's installed, we're going to type E S build dash uh, P Android. And once we do that, it's going to ask us to log in to expo now on this case it's not going to do that because i'm already logged in but i'm going to leave a link in the description of where you can uh, make an expo account and then log in through visual studio code after you log in it's going to start the build or uh, have a build queue so you want to do control c and stop it and navigate to your eeas.json file now I'm going to leave a link in the description for uh, the expo docs um, and this is the website where we're going to take this line of command. So we're just going to copy uh, all the way from build to preview three, uh, copy it and paste it into the EAS JSON file. And after we do that, uh, we want to copy and paste the command uh, in the Expo website. Again, the link will be in the description. Um, and this is the APK docs. So you copy that, you paste that into the terminal. And from now, uh, this is when your APK should be generated. Um, in this case, again, it's going to queue it uh, because I just made an app not too long ago. Um, but I'm just going to wait and show you what happened. So now it should give you a link to download your APK, download your APK. And now we're going to install it. Uh, my phone is giving me a warning saying that they don't recognize this developer, but since I recognize the developer, <laughs> it's me, I'm just going to install it and open it. And as you can see, we have uh, the calculator app operating and working. So yeah, that's pretty much how you turn a React Native app into an APK and use it on your phone. So if you like this tutorial and it was helpful for you, please leave a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. Till the next one, guys. Peace out.